Hello, this is Illusory Thrall, and welcome back to my modded Mega Hospital playthrough. So we are back with Project Hospital, and last week we decided that this week we need to get another CT scan machine. Um, I also kind of want to expand to another MRI. And maybe another CT after that. Just because we're probably going to need them when we start expanding to other, um, other departments. I want to have that capability there. The other thing that I need to do before I go to another department is I want to expand the trauma center because right now we only have the six beds and we actually have more even in ICU which we haven't even used yet. So trauma needs to be um, fitted out and I need at least three rooms so we won't be looking at expanding this anytime in the next probably two to three episodes unless I go into debt further, which I'd rather not do because we're still at 200. I can see going to 400, but nothing over it. So, what we're going to do is we're going to get back into gameplay and we're going to take care of some more patients, send some more folks home, hopefully. Get some more stuff taken care of. Uh, you had a physical exam? And you're hospitalized. Uh, let's let the doctors take care of you. Let's send you home. And said, you can go home. Physical... Oh, you have an abscess. You need incision and drainage. Let's get that taken care of. You can be taken care of. Same with you. Interview. How are we doing? I feel like you have insomnia. Can I double check on the controlled patients and make sure I didn't miss anybody? I didn't. Okay. You need fracture surgery. So that's what we're going to send you to do. You have a dislocated ankle. Let's hospitalize you. I mean, probably doesn't need it, but I'd rather be safe rather than sorry. We'll send you to the lab. I'm gonna send you there. You there. Uh. We know about temperature. No, we don't. So let's do that. Interview. You have sleeping issues? Me too. Let's do those. Interview. Let's also check for skin allergies. Let's give you some pain meds before we send you home. You should be good 
to go home the next day. Okay, chest x-ray gave us nothing. Which means it's one of the other many things you could have. Can we check legs next? Let's give you some meds. Interview for you. You have some back stiffness. Simple fracture. Should be able to do that without anything else. You need that. Oh wait. Uh, hip replacement. We can leave you on regular, I think. Physical... I think this one should just go straight for a back x-ray. You, antihistamines, can go home. Ice wrap, also home. Rest, home. You should be good to go home. My character needs to stop taking care of themselves and get back to work. Um, this guy will send for an x-ray. Spondyliosis. How much is it? 500, we don't want to EMS. Analgesics, you can go home. Evaluation, insomnia, let's take care of this one. Ice wrap, off you go. Probably golfer's elbow would be my guess. Um, let's give you EMS and some of that. Bone infection. Oh, that's not good. You, let's get you feeling better before we send you for surgery. Uh, yeah, you can go home. Hand contusion. Go home with your bruise. Okay, interview. Fracture. Let's get you more comfortable. Physical exam. You need an x-ray. Interview. Let's also do a chest oscitation since you're coughing and a temperature measurement. You, that was easy. Let's do that. Um, you can go home. Let's do a quick check through. You have not even gotten to anybody. Oh, that's not good. Let's do this. Because there's something going on wrong here. You can be done that way. Open fracture. Wow. Okay. 
soon as you get back to there, we will send you off to where you need to go. Can we do an eye exam for this guy? Yeah. And maybe also a skin allergy test. Numbing ointment, you can go home. How are we doing on this? We've got 30 of 40. Iron deficiency, we'll get that taken care of. Interview. Let's also do an evaluation for you. Goodness, everybody got interviewed all at once. Okay, who else are we waiting for? Nobody? Okay. Yes, you have a fever. Let's... Also do that. You can go home. And you should be good. Um Eval. You are a specialist and you even got the right specialty. Look at you go. Interview. Alright, we're gonna take care of that before we do anything else. Whoa! Okay, you need to be switched here. You have an open fracture, so you need to go straight to there. Um. Headache and fever. Um, what are our possibilities? Oh my god. Uh, shit. Can we do this and this? This, this, and this. Because we don't know a whole lot. Uh, apparently we already found out for that guy. You... need all of that, like, now. You need that, and that. Already did that one. Interview, physical exam. Interview. Let's do this and a skin allergy test. Uh, send you home. Okay. Then I should be able to afford to get me another CT room. At least that's what I would like to do right now. Put you right here. Let me put in. Uh, well, no, that's not gonna work. I need to just grab the technologists. Nope, nope, nope. Um, you would be okay. And you're okay. Okay. That'll work. 
Uh, let's go back to here. Back to here so I can see who is... You need to be prioritized. Because you are high hazard. Alright, so let's go again. Nice wrap. Fracture surgery. Okay. Evaluation. You need a vitamin D supplement. So let's do that. And says you can go home. We're one more away from 130 today. And we need to get to 160. Well, we might get there. Okay, skin allergy for you, physical exam. That didn't tell us a darn thing. So off you go for that. You came back from the lab. You go home. We'll do that. And then we'll take care of that and see if that works for you. Arm cast. You can go home. Let's do this. Interview. You need this. Can we check your temperature because you have chills? Physical exam. I hate to tell you, but you need to go get in line for a chest x-ray. Bandage. Can we do a physical exam before we send you home? Just to be sure. Okay, you are ready for surgery. Means you can go home. I thought we might need those. Can we do this? 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 And this? You are getting taken care of. Senior janitor. Nice. Interview. What do you have? Probably shingles, since I don't think we have... Yeah, we don't have the other department. Fungal infection. Way to go, lab. We figured it out. That's a hundred and forty. Let's send you straight to surgery. You can go home. Let's make sure I don't have anybody but him waiting. Okay. You can go home. I was right. You have shingles. You can go home. You need to go for that. Interview. I'm almost feeling like we need another operating room. I don't like thinking that. Alright, let's check.
skin allergies for you too. You've been stabilized. Let's physically exam you. Get you feeling a little better. Okay, so it has to be this one. Which means we need to do serologic for you. Did I miss it? I feel like I did. There's the blood draw. There it is. I did miss it. Okay. Arm contusion. Okay, physics exam. We're gonna just do that for out of place ankle. Let's do that. Take care of that. And why didn't X ray in the back do anything? Oh, because we're supposed to X ray the chest. Thrall. What are you doing? Okay, you... Go elsewhere. What are you doing now? Filling needs. I'd really rather you not. Oh, Miss Annoying over here. That didn't help. Maybe it's an upper limb? You had hip replacement. Let's double check on you. Let's give you some antivirals, send you home, because I don't want shingles. Physical exam for you. You should be good. You have a tibia fracture. Whoops, we can't transport you yet. Okay. You can go home. Okay, well, apparently you need an x ray. We'll get in line. Uh, okay, so we're still good here. Sally? How do we check between these? Chest oscitation would help. Nasal cavity would help. We don't know about your temperature. So let's do those. Numbing ointment, you can go home. Interview. We're gonna check those for you. Um, you had hip replacement surgery. I don't know what they need to do for you, so you will let them do it. Okay, eight patients away, broken ribs. Let's do those. Depression ribs. Seven patients away. Oh. You here. Give you a leg cast. Ice wrap, you can go home. You had fracture surgery. And are doing okay. Stabilization. Let's do a physical exam. 
and those. Temperature... Still could be either. I think we need to send you for serologic. Okay, where's the blood test? Well, there's serologic. Okay. Okay. You. We'll do that. Okay, you are now an attending. Congratulations. I suppose. Because that's one of our surgical assistants. Temperature measurement. You are also going to need to be sent for serologic testing. Uh, phys exam. We know what you now have. You are going to need those. Let's also get you an interview. Okay. How far are we? We're several away. That didn't help. Ah. <sighs> Okay, I really want to just do a differential at this point. Can I do that with this doctor? Yeah. Interview. You have a nasal fracture? Probably. So we're just going to do that. Interview. You have chicken pox. Okay, who has the fibula fracture? We'll wait till you get back. Dominal. Differential. What did it tell us? It's either. It could be a nasal fracture. Can we try that? Because I would think we would have seen it on the other ones had it been those. Let's try that. You have back pain, so we're going to check on you. Oh, uh, you have a nasal fracture. Let's also send you for a head x-ray. Well, now we know what you have. Yay, that's five left. Physical exam. Ah, uh, physical exam. Alright. You still have symptoms. Can we do a check on you? We're going to HDU hospitalize. Let's get you comfortable. Let's do... you can go home. You can go home. If I do those, you'll be able to go home. X-ray... let's give you a leg cast. And we'll send you there. Exercise. That should be good for you. Two more to go. Nose fracture. Uh, I think the close reduction can be done without anything else. You had a physical still didn't find what you need. Okay. You had a knee dislocation. Let's get
get you more comfortable. Need one more. That would be you. Ding. That means we got through the day. 160. Okay, so what is our next thing do for us? Uh, 180. Oh, it just gives us more clinic patients. I was hoping for cash, guys. Well, piffle. However, we are getting kind of close to this. Like, we might very well get closer to it with this next one. Which would be very nice. So let's let's save. And we're going to end here. We do still have a fairly large amount of people waiting for surgeries. So let's do a quick check up here and make sure Things are still going okay. These guys idle. Um, you had a fracture of the nose. I mean, we can do this, I think. Physical exam didn't help for you. Eh. Why did I get back into doing this? Let's get to a back x-ray. Yeah, let's do the back x-ray. And you had surgery. Let's give you a physical exam now. Because I think... I think this is working out okay. You are getting ready for surgery, yeah. Hip replacement surgery. I don't know why he's happening before this one. Doesn't make a whole lot of sense. You get in line for surgery. Okay, you already had surgery. You already had a physical exam. Let's let the doctors take care of you. Uh, you have hay fever, so let's do this. Interview. This should find your shingles. Take care of those. You are taken care of. You can go home. How close are we? We're at 161. So yeah, we're doing good for the day. However, let's... Let's get you taken care of. And we'll do yet another save. And we'll call this here for today. Um, I will see you next time where we will attempt to be getting another MRI machine. That's our top priority, I believe. Um, so yeah, I will see you guys next time. Everybody take care. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and a subscribe if you enjoyed the content. Feel free to leave me a comment. I'll get back to you. And I will see you next week.